Hello everybody, welcome back. Thank you for joining me for another video. All right, today's video is a special one for many reasons. Uh, first off, it is a collaboration with all kinds of amazing YouTube artists. So if you haven't seen the people prior to me or the people after me, there will be a link where you can click on it and you can see everybody's videos. This is a collaboration for the Fluid Art Experience that is happening in Seattle, Washington, uh, April 27th to the 29th. I will be there and I will be teaching all kinds of classes, six different classes from a white base Dutch pour to a black base Dutch pour to a color split Dutch pour. Then we've got a uh, resin class where I will teach you how to use resin and your TLP piggies in resin to do a nice abstract piece. I will also be teaching a Dutch pour on a large scale canvas and a diptych, so a two piece class. All right, so there's all kinds of classes to be taken and you can check out the website www.fluidartexperience.com for all the information and to purchase tickets. There is going to be a gala event where you can buy tickets and have a sit down dinner and sit and there's going to be an auction and all kinds of fun. There's a meet and greet that's happening on one of the nights. This event is going to be so much fun. I cannot wait till the end of April and I hope to see you guys there. Um, so really quickly, I wanted to show you guys the dried results of some of my previous videos. So this was actually, we'll do, I guess it really doesn't matter, but this was the purple one I had done. So dried beautifully, still needs a top coat of crystal resin, but you can definitely see the pretty shimmer in that. And then of course the pink piece. So here's the pink one really happy with how that turned out as well so both of these are on 14 by 14 inch canvases and they are available for purchase for anyone who is interested you can email me at canalaseraco at gmail.com all right so in today's video i am working on a 16 by 20 inch canvas and this is going to be one of the things i'm teaching in my classes in seattle this is going to be a black base dutch pour and it's one of the things I'm teaching in the class and I'm going to be using some really nice metallic colors and we're going to get started in a minute. But this piece is a very special piece because it's going to someone super special. I'm not going to say names yet because it's a surprise. However, um, this piece I am doing for a very special person and I will let that person know uh, in a little bit. But uh, I can't divulge that information just yet. So the colors I'm going to be using are Oxide Black by Amsterdam. And then the colors, there's a lot of colors here, but um, we've got Antique Copper by Folk Art. Then I have 24 Karat Gold by Deco Art. Then I have Van Dyke Brown by Amsterdam. We got a little Pearl Cream by, now I always say Arteza, and I finally realized and found out the other day, it's actually Arteza. Um, and the only reason I know that is because I got a call from the company and we had a chat about some uh, stuff and she kept saying, oh, Arteza and Arteza. And I'm like, oh my gosh, this whole time I've been calling it Arteza and it's actually pronounced Arteza. So Arteza, but I'll probably still call it Arteza because that's what I'm used to. Um, then we have Bronze by Amsterdam. Then we have Warm Gray by Amsterdam. And then topping it off, I have Pearl Deep Brown by Arteza. <laughs> Arteza. Uh, my hair dryer is on the floor. So I'm going to be using my flower. My, I'm shaking everything. I've got the flower hair dryer. All right. And for those of you who are new watching and want to know how I mix my paints, I mix them with water and Floetrol. And if you want to know the ratios on how I mix all my paints, including my base paint, Check out video number 434. I will link it up here at the top. Click on that link and it'll take you right to the video that shows you the ratios on how I mix my paints. All right, I'm going to flood my canvas and I'll be right back. Thank you. 
All right, everybody, canvas is flooded. I'm ready to go. Now, I've been really liking the composition I've been doing with the purple and the pink. And although this is a bigger canvas, I'm gonna stick to that composition um, because I actually really like it. So, and it's gonna be easier to blow out because it's on a bigger canvas. So let's get started here. Uh, let's see, I think I'll start here and go across like this. I think that should be good. I gotta concentrate on my first lines. The rest after that is a follow, but I think that's good. Yes, that should work. All right, so while I'm doing these lines here and paying attention not to overdo it on the 24K, because we all know what happens when you put way too much 24 karat gold, it will take over and eat up all your other colors. So I've been counting down the days for Seattle. I cannot wait to see some familiar faces. I'll be seeing uh, Tara from Pieces of Tara again, um, Kathleen, Cause Creations, Massey Art Studios, um, Marcy, Mixed Media Girl, Cole from Cole's Color. Um, trying to think, there's I think 11 of us and I'm gonna see some new faces I'm finally going to get to meet Gina DeLuca. I'm so excited. And Garrick Brown, uh, Sarah Taylor from Sarah Taylor Modern Art. There's going to be some new faces and I cannot wait to see everyone. I hope I did not forget anyone. Please tell me I didn't forget anyone. Um, if I did, I'm so sorry. I'm trying to think who else. Um, oh gosh, I can't remember. But anyways, I'm super excited to see old faces and new faces and it's going to be such a great time i've never been to the west coast i'm excited to go i'm excited to check out what's happening out in the west coast so i can't wait so check out the website and get your tickets all right so colors are down and let me pop the bubbles there's a lot of paint on here which is fine. Most of it will probably get blown off the edge anyway. All right, my torch is running out of butane. Okay, so I think I'm going to, I'm gonna knock things over here. That's what I'm gonna about to do. All right, so I'm gonna start here and work my way down and then see where I go from there. Let's get started. Um, first of all, this turned out stunning. I think I actually perfected the blowout on this one. Um, oh my gosh, this new color I have, the Warm Gray by Amsterdam. Although it's called Warm Gray, I don't know why it's called gray because it looks like, I'm, I better not hold it from the tip and drop it because then I'll be really mad at myself but anyways it's more of a taupey beige color to me I don't know why they call it gray but it looks so beautiful in here I'm so stoked about this piece because this is going to be um a gift for a very special person 
And I'll tell you who that is in an upcoming video, like down the road, but I can't say it right now or else it'll spoil the surprise. But um, I'm only worried about this. I'm just worried about this touching and I hope it doesn't. I may um, blow just a little bit of this brown that way um, just to make sure that they don't touch because I, I really like the way this looks. Um, so I may just try and fidget with that a little bit, but not this part. Just this brown part, I'll have to literally climb over the table on this side, which I won't do on camera, so, because you don't want to see that. But I love it! Oh my gosh! This is perfect! Okay, so I am not touching anything on this piece, with the exception of that, and I'll show you that in a close-up, uh, in the close-up when I'm done fixing that. But aside from that, I'm not touching anything else. So let me work on fixing that. And I will touch up my edges and I'm going to bring you guys in for a close up. Be right back. All right, here it is. And I just, oh, I was going to say, where's my stick? Got to take your stick. I got to switch hands though. <laughs> take your stick and you want to scrape those drips. All right. Do all four sides, come back. Do it again, cover these white spots. Don't leave white spots on, oh geez, on your canvas. All right, so scrape all four sides, come back and do it again 10 minutes later, and then a third time and you should be good to go. Now, let's check out this. Look at the cells, it's insane. And unfortunately, even though I keep pushing this spot back, it keeps coming back. So they may touch, they may not, I'm not really sure. I may squirt some black right there in, in the center and see if I can push it apart a little bit, but it is what it is. Otherwise, I'm just, I'm so in love with this piece. Cannot wait to see it dry. Let's check it out with the flash on. All right, so I've got the flash on, but it is an extremely sunny day today, but I don't think that's gonna make a difference because you're definitely going to see the shimmer in this. I'm trying to go closer so that the flash is actually effective. But there is a lot of shimmer in this. It's insane. Look at this. Wow. And then this is my one of my favorite parts here. I did add some black. You see how I added black right there, right in here. So hopefully that spreads it apart enough for it to stay apart. Look at the cells. This is insane. Now I just gotta hope and pray it dries like this and doesn't move, which it shouldn't, but we'll see. And there you have it, everybody. Um, let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. The 16 by 20 inch, I'd say it's available, but it's not. Um, I'll let you guys know who it's for in a little while. But um, let me know what you guys think about the colors and how it looks on a black base. I did these similar colors on a black and white split base, but now it's fully black. So let me know what you think. And don't forget, check out the previous YouTube artists in this collaboration before me and the ones that are after me. So, um, and don't forget to check out the website and come and see us in Seattle, Washington, April 27th to the 29th. Book your tickets now. Time is running out. All right. So that is it for me for now. I hope to see you guys in Seattle. Until next time, my friends, thank you so much for watching. Have a good day. Have a good night. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye.